uh, how would I describe the evolution of Crackle? Uh, we've really progressed to be more of a premium player in the marketplace. So all of the content now on Crackle are full-length movies, full-length TV shows, and our originals as well, which used to be short form, are now either feature length or full-length series. Uh, we think it fits very nicely into the category. Now, people don't watch just one premium TV network like an HBO or one ad-supported uh, show like um, or network like an NBC. And so the same is true in the digital world. You can have services like Netflix, which has some great content, and Hulu as well for Next Day TV. But for a programmed network that has great movies, interesting originals, fantastic television like Seinfeld, and Shield, and Rescue Me, Crackle fits really nicely into that portfolio. Yes. I think, uh, you know, I won't disclose, but I know our economics, and we're, we're very happy with it. Um, you know, there's some other channels that have ads supported on one platform, and then they try and go subscription on another platform. Or they have it for free and ad supported for some set of content, and not for another set of content. It's confusing to the customer, it's hard to build out, it puts the economics into a very different place. And so it's not just about the revenue line, it's about the profit line. I we think we're growing a great business. We're reaching a lot of consumers on all platforms with terrific content, and we're really happy with them all.